John Cross, a well-sourced journalist in England working for The Mirror, saying that Meza Urza is telling his friends that he's going to Manchester United <laughs> in January. Uh, what do you make of this, Maris? Well, when you told me the news, Dan, I said, pardon? Yes, yeah, so, but that could be your age. It, it, <laughs> well, it, it could be, but it, it's not. And, and I wonder, look, Mourinho knows, knows what he's doing, but I, it, this is a head-scratcher for me. Mm. Obviously, Pogba, we, we really don't know how long he's going to be uh, coming back. Mkhitaryan, it looks as though, to me, he's going to be on the chopping block because Mesut Ozil, for me, can only play in that 10 roles. You can't play him wide. No. You, you certainly can't play him in the holding role. That's ridiculous. So somebody in that dressing room has gone, uh-oh, that's a little bit more running for me. Obviously, Mourinho's got something up his sleeve. Sure. But it's a puzzler for me. Does this fit? I just don't see how it fits. And I say that because I think Mesut Ozil is a luxury player. And... Mm. You look at what Jose demands out of every single player on Manchester United, and there are no luxuries taken. And sure. To Paul's point, it means a lot more running and closing down. The one thing that you will say is, one, he's different than any other player on, at, at Manchester United. And two, if you, if you think about the way they defend, sometimes they defend a little bit deeper. They need that connector to, mm -hmm. to either Lukaku or Martial or... Anybody that's going to get in behind. Rashford has the pace to do that. So if you, you, you get Mesut Ozil on the ball and you want to play over the top and spring, spring someone quickly, I well, can that, see that. But, Brian, that's a massive gamble. It if is. You, if you're going to defend with less numbers, mm -hmm. if you're going to say, OK, Ozil, you just hang out there, wait till you get the ball and then spring the attack, that's risky. It is. If you look at Manchester United, though, they're set up to defensively. So right. they've got a good understanding. If it means they defend with nine instead of ten, I think that... that is something they can play to. But for me, I'm with you. I don't, I don't understand the signing. No. There's no question that Mesut Ozil is a talented player. Mm. And there's a relationship here with, between Jose Mourinho and Mesut Ozil going back to the days of Real Madrid. So maybe, maybe, as many managers tend to be, the ones that can find the magic <laughs> answer, the one that can say, I can get the best out of this guy. Yeah. I can turn around his attitude. I can change his mindset. And I can get the best out of him on the field. Maybe that's Jose Mourinho, and maybe that works for Mesut Ozil. But if you're going to ask Mesut Ozil to go defend, like you've, uh, you have asked everybody else to do at Manchester United, good <laughs> luck with that. Because we have seen that that does not work for Mesut Ozil.